it feels great to be back out here and it's uh, been a transition especially with the whole situation of the pandemic going around but getting back into things and getting back as a full team is really good to see and it's really exciting. And the first two weeks were probably the most challenging definitely for the staff and, and get a great session out and then as we've gone to the third and now the fourth week we've been able to do things that uh, have gro we've grown into things that uh, really look like us and look like Marquette. Yeah, I mean it's always a process getting the new guys because we have a standard and we have a culture here that everyone has to kind of accustom to so getting them on board as fast as we can is really the most important thing so us upperclassmen have been trying to help them every step along the way so it takes some time, but I think they're getting used to it. Well, I think we're going to have 45 minutes. We're not going to do 90. We'll do 45 minutes, and it will be a definite snapshot of some of the great things that we'll be doing and some of the things that we're progressing to, to be able to do those kind of things for 90 minutes. We do have some exciting players. It's a chance for you to see some of the new, some of the returning, and some of the improvements. Uh, they should definitely tune in because, uh, obviously, every year we got returners, we got uh, new guys coming in and it's always an exciting time, especially since we don't have a fall season, we're all buzzing and ready to get back into things. So we all have great energy and we're really looking to get back uh, to playing competitive games. So uh, it's uh, still fun and competitive, so everyone should tune in and watch. It definitely gives a little bit of a, a, a boost to our guys and I'm sure for all the Marquette soccer fans, it'll give a boost for you guys to see guys wearing our colors on our field in a nicely groomed and a proper match setup.